Hello there, this is Pastor Dean from Healing Hands of Jesus Ministries. I just want five minutes of your time. We had a wonderful service tonight. The Holy Spirit was there. If you need prayer, if you have cancer, if you have a financial difficulty, regardless of what the situation is, please contact me here at Healing Hands of Jesus. The prayer posse gets together and folks, for some reason, God has anointed Healing Hands of Jesus to be a miracle ministry. We want to pray for you. We're not bragging about us. We're bragging about the Lord. Our Lord God loves us so much that he wants to create miracles. He wants to take impossible situations and make them possible. He wants our joy if, if, if the devil has robbed you from joy, God wants to restore it, but you've got to ask him in faith to do that. You know, can I just say this one thing? I'm going to take a look at some notes from my sermon tonight. <laughs> you can make a decision right now that will create limitless joy in your life. I know for a fact, I, 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 listen, your decisions, your decisions eventually create your ultimate joy. When someone is joyful, they constantly create energy. Joy is energy. And you know what? The more joyful you are, the more contagious it is. I'm asking you right now, I'm going to cover this all week this week, but if you would like a limitless amount of joy, you've got to make a couple of decisions, and the first one that you've got to make tonight is to make the Word of God, the Word of God, your ultimate moral authority. Ask God right now, or tell God right now, Father, starting tonight, I am going to make the Bible my ultimate authority. I am going to proclaim tonight that my decision is to accept the Word of God as the infallible wisdom of God. Make that decision for the Bible to be your boss. You make that decision, and whatever your situation is, your joy will return. You can be terminally ill, or the doctors can say you're terminally ill. You can be in the most impossible financial situation there is. I'm telling you, if you make the decision to use the Word of God, the Bible, as your infallible source of wisdom that is the first decision in your joy and your life turning around. I'm telling you, I know from experience. In fact, it says in 2 Timothy 3.16, all scripture is inspired by God and is useful to teach us what is true and to make us realize what is wrong in our lives. It connects us when we are wrong and teaches us to do what is right. 2 Timothy 3.16. Listen, I love you. I'm going to try to do a five-minute tape every day, and thank you for requesting it. Thank you for, for uh, sharing this. Please share this. We love you at Healing Hands of Jesus, and we want to pray for you. We want to see as many miracles as possible take place so that we can have testimony after testimony to tell others so that they will believe that God is alive and can do the same thing for them. God bless you, and we'll talk to you tomorrow. Make the Bible your infallible source of wisdom. This is Pastor Dean Pepin. And these are Miracle Minutes. God bless you. Contact me if you need prayer. God bless you. I love you. Bye-bye.